oh my god guys my entertainment center stroke tv stand is already up and it's looking so good please ignore the messy whatever cause it's just finished like i was like i can't wait any longer wow guys this is truly beautiful and remember this is diy tv stand stroke entertainment centerpiece so guys what do you think did this diy go to hell or did this diy just go to heaven oh my god guys can you see this let me switch off the lights for you oh guys guys welcome back to my channel my name is Esperen Shaperita aka Amy Sweet so today guys I am planning on DIY TV stand stroke entertainment centerpiece and the first thing I'm gonna do is like note down what I need the needed materials or requirements for the project so I'm just gonna do okay the needed and we all know I need the softboard stroke the MDF and I need screws mm, I also need uh, I need like a whole lot of things guys and I hope you continue staying tuned so that you check out this video cause I know it's gonna be lit it's gonna be lit guys currently it's at 6 45 a.m. in the morning and yes we wake up early to plan for DIYs cause later on I have to go shop for the requirements most likely in Gikomba and somewhere near Karyobangi. So guys I'll be seeing you later please continue staying tuned let me continue doing this. So guys, after the requirements or the needed whatever for the project, I started I started to be like, okay, what do I want to make? So I'm just drawing a few sketch sketches down so that I choose from them which one I will go with. In that I have or how do I say this? Like I want a TV centerpiece and I also want it to be somehow like my editing area on the other side. So I'm just like trying a few a few sketches and see what will happen and which one I will decide on. So guys, as you can see, these are some of the sketches. I have that one, I have number two, I have number three. So I have these three. I just have to decide which one I want or which one I will go with. And currently, I do not know 
but number one has been at the back of my mind for the longest time possible so let's just see as the day unfolds The MDF is already set up and here we are loading it on a motorbike to carry it to my location. It's already like it may cut into the pieces I wanted. So yes, let's go. Hi guys. So it's been a long day but you can see you may buy new door. New door. This is a hammer for those who do not know what Nyundo is and you can see my pieces and all these are the things that I bought at Gikomba and this is TV bracket the other one I had ilibaki kwa nyumba nilihama juu ilikatalia kwa wall so I had to buy another one for my centerpiece and another thing I bought is let me just show you DIY investment so this is a drill guys an electric drill so i bought this at three thousand three thousand three thousand like who oh, and these are lights the christmas lights but this is blue in color i can't wait to try these lights on later when the centerpiece goes up and guys i want to make a throw blanket from this so i bought this one and a quarter meters at 1625 that is 1625 at gikomba yes just need to wash and take to a fundi or a tailor to like an fungi kando kando but it's so beautiful guys can you see so another color is coming up in this house just continue waiting you shall know and guys you see this this is blue I'm gonna refurbish my seat and this is the color that is going on I can't wait to see how it turns out these are like 12 meters that's too much but okay and here is another thing oh my god I'm gonna like these are a whole lot of projects but okay let's see how they turn out as I said guys please just hold a little bit on because a major project is coming up and guys I bought this so that I can put on my my seat after it's refurbished can you see how it's beautiful guys I bought eight of them because my seat has eight legs is it legs eight stands no they're not stands eight legs <laughs> whatever I decide that is what I'm gonna go with eight legs so yes here they are and they're so beautiful they are amazing I bought one at 150 one at 150 so 150 times 8 that is 1200 yes they're looking so beautiful guys can you see that I can't wait to do these things time I just need time and do this DIYs time to do this day was i missed diy guys and I, I was like i'm going all in i don't care whatever i'm just like going in and this is cable internet cable is it ethernet yes internet cable i bought 50 meters because i've been waiting for this guy to come and you can net manzi since i moved jay kwana net so i bought the cable waiting for him to come so you can see the legs are ready to be like who i can't wait and my drill is right here i'm feeling so good that my diy store is improving because <laughs> i've started buying equipment and who can't be happier so yes my lights and that is all i bought and most of them i bought them at gikomba except the board because i couldn't like get the board from the compact where i live so i bought the board in another area and here let me just show you i bought these screws these two are for my table centerpiece so i had to like you see i have different inches of screws here just waiting to start on them you see different size here as you can see there you go guys 
I can't wait to start on this project. Ooh, guys, what do you say? What do you want to say? Because this is going to be amazing. This is going to be big. I don't know about you, but to me, it's going to be big. Like it will be my first time going this big with a DIY project. But I'm so like I'm energized. I am full of hope and I'm ready to go. So yes, all this I bought them today for the DIY and these are cable pins or cable clips if you wish. Yes, for my internet cable and for my lights behind my entertainment center. Yeah, I bought two pieces, two pieces, two packets. Pa are they packets? I don't know. Two boxes. They're, they're not box. Oh, I don't know. Guys, you can see I bought two. And guys, 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 are you excited? Do you want to see what comes up? And guys, these are brackets. I don't know what you, somebody may call them hinges, but they add brackets right the brackets yeah and guys ta -da! the process has begun so the first thing we're doing is we're measuring because we don't want just to start like doing one two three so we have to measure discuss on the length everything before the project starts and yes measuring kamakawa ida moving everything and measuring so that we start on the project So guys, here are the boards. I bought actually one board at 3700. That was the MDF white one, 3700. And these pieces of wood you can see, one against the wall and the other one on top. I bought 100, I bought them at 100 each. That is 200 because I only bought two. So yes, as you can see, we are ready to go. I can't wait to see this thing like I drew it and I can't wait to see it on the wall like I can't wait to see it functional guys I am really waiting
so guys it's time to use the drill here we go and you can't imagine like i'm really terrified about the drill because the noise it makes i feel i feel like irritated so i'll just like try because this is my project and that's why i have this great friend of mine right here helping me out through this process so the first thing we want to do is like we want to mount the tv so we're just trying to get the correct measurements and we are referring to the picture or to the image that i chose among the three i had drawn so you just want to know where the tv will be and how big is it like we are getting correct measurements because where this is a project that I've not done before. After correct measurements, we started drilling. Yes, and oh, Alishika yo nini na nimoto? Oh, ameungo marambili kai. So guys, after placing the the is it what the cage ya TV, we are now trying to like work at the shelves, the smaller shelves, and here we go. I'm holding it on this side as he's drilling on the other side. I'm sorry about the camera movement because we all we don't have any other person to hold the camera, so it's just there on one side. But I'm hoping to change it soon.
So guys, after struggling for some time, cause none of us has used a drill before, none of us have done like any of this project. So it's just something that I drew and explained to a friend, and we were like, okay, let's try and do this. This is a DIY project, and even if it comes out mazugudaniyo, nobody can judge us, cause it's a DIY project, you know. So yes, after a long time, we mounted the two shelves and this big shelf and who oh, the weight of this this thing is really heavy and i'm really trying though i'm getting tired and exhausted So guys, let me show you real quick how the back of this thing looks like. As you can see, we are doing screw screwdrivers, no screws. We are you can see the black spots, those are screws and others zimekata kuingia zingine zinafanya vituko where zingine tunafanya manually like things here are not working the way we expected. Menyewe vitu kwa ground ni different kabisa kabisa. So when we try to drive in a screw and it refuses, we decide to do it manually like push it in with a screwdriver ile manual one. And now we are just drilling because we decided to try another method, drilling from behind and doing smaller screws and let's see how this turns out. So luckily guys we got the first shelf up not the first the okay the first big shelf up and we just want to add this brackets so that it is strong enough because this part I'm gonna do my books I'm gonna turn it into a library so yes and here we go drilling it So guys, these are some of the final stages of the 
DIY centerpiece and currently we are putting on the lights and we are just like using the cable cable clips to hold the lights at the back of the board so that this light goes to the wall and then reflects back to the room i hope it works and these are blue blue lights i bought these lights at 200 bob that is river road i didn't get the ones i wanted the strip one so i went with this and because this project is on a budget i was like wow this is a great deal so i went in and bought this and i hope they work out perfectly hey these clips is in a sumboyawa <laughs> the clips are stubborn as i don't know what And because this girl can't wait, I decided to put on the light so that I see how they turn out. And who? Oh, I'm loving this. I am loving this so, so much. Who, guys. Can you see this? I can't wait to mount this thing on the wall. So after we finished mounting the lights, I turned off the steamer and guys, see what is happening here. See what is happening here. This is beautiful guys. I do not know about you, but who oh, this is beautiful. Movie night. Popcorns. We are Netflixing and chilling. What do you think guys? Netflix and chill. Who? Oh, see how beautiful it is guys. Can you see that? So I switched on the lights again and it is done. We are just trying to figure out how we will mount this on the wall and how we are going to hide the cables after we mount this thing. This table centerpiece, this entertainment centerpiece, not a table centerpiece. Oh my god, why this table centerpiece in my mind? So just trying to figure out how we will mount it up and here we go. So we decided we are going to have these two up. And then we're gonna carry this TV stand and place it on this tool. And then while Calvin will be like, Atakuwa kigongelea, I'll be trying and hold it up so that it doesn't go down. And guys, niombe because hey, this thing is heavy. It is heavy and oh, Jesus Christ. So guys, here I am and we're just trying to like finish up adding more nails, more concrete nails so that this thing is like, it should be strong enough and here we go. We need to do this and I don't know if I can cause hey, this thing is really, really heavy. But let's just try and see because this tool was too tall. We decided to get a poof but this poof in kadogo so here we go we're just gonna add like pillows i don't know if they will help but let's just do it okay here we go who 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 guys this thing is heavy you could just see it like looking like this and you could be like this thing is light why did they just carry it like that oh my god imagine putting it up putting it down and here we go Where? guys i can't wait to just have this thing permanently up there because huh, this is hectic
so guys as you can see this was the plan like we just put it up here so that it's somewhere close to the wood so that while i'm trying to put all my energy there calvin will be like hammering it up so that it sticks to the wall where pray for us we are already tired who the sabal is me So guys, after everything was all placed up, we realized that the knee was like, it was slanting on one side and we were like, no, we need to fix this. This is a DIY, but we need to fix it. It needs to be like somehow perfect. So we went in and removed and guess what? The, the wall like was like coming down. In that place, you will just see in a few. So guys, after doing ABCD, doing what the wall wanting to fall and everything, it balanced. We are using like a small what like a small uh, spirit level that I bought with the TV brackets, and it is helping. By the way, it's so tiny, but it's helping. So yes, at the moment it is straight, and we are like, this is good. We are gonna go with this. And we just like want to drill in a few screws so that it can be steady and strong on the wall. So guys, after screwing and everything, this is what we have. What do you think guys? This is so beautiful. I do not know about you. And at the moment, the TV has not yet been mounted. But who? Can you see this? The lights are off, yes. But just trying to give you a picture of how this thing will look like. I don't know if you love it, you hate it, guys. I love it. And boom, guys, this is the final one. I have like this place is messy because you know, the, like, this is like construction. Construction was going on here, and 
I've not yet even done like cleaning and what, but who oh, can you see this guys? I am loving this project. My DIY entertainment center is beautiful. It is amazing. Guys, remember to give me a thumbs up. Remember to subscribe. Remember to like leave me comments. Subscribe, subscribe, share with your friends, guys, and please write my DIY TV stand stroke entertainment center. I'll be seeing you guys in my next video. Peace out.